Hey guys, it's 2 Pro Few Games or Adam, welcome back to some more Black Ops 3 Zombies. And uh, in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to craft every single buildable here on Zatsuba no Shima by round 9. This is kind of my setting up speed run. Uh, if you guys want to see like more speed runs of like specifically setting up the getting the skull by a, in a really low round, uh, let me know in the comment section below. Um, but this is every buildable on round 9. So I'm not going to commentate the entire video because it is a uh, half an hour long video. It's my entire setup. Um, but I'm going to give you some pointers here and uh, the new you guys can watch me set up and uh, just kind of follow what I do all right so uh, right off the bat uh, perkaholic uh, you want to get perkaholic first hit if you don't get it first hit then uh, quit the game and uh, come back in now if you don't have perkaholic or you don't want to use perkaholic uh, I'd recommend putting the double points on the double point scobble gum and getting that first hit um, it actually would be better to do the, the double points one but the reason why I like perkaholic is because you have to stay in the spawn room until roughly the end of round four because you need 5,000 points the more you can get the better but you need at least 5,000 points to get to where I'm going uh, at the beginning of this video all right so at least 5k uh, and the widow's wine you get from perkaholic will make the zombies a one knife uh, the entire time you are in the starting room so that helps out a lot but again the devil points works very well as well here and besides that just a couple of other things uh, get the Bowie knife. I get it in this in this video. It's incredibly helpful. It gives you a ton of points. And I was not running the double points cobble gum in this video. Um, if you do, you could probably get this done a lot earlier. And uh, the only reason why I, I had it done on round nine is, uh, or that's a little bit late, honestly, because I think I had everything done by round eight, actually, but I was waiting for that vial to drop from the zombie. So uh, what might happen to you guys is you'll have everything done by around nine or eight, but it may take up until uh, 10 or 11 to actually get that vial to drop from the zombie. Sometimes you'll get lucky and you'll get that vial to drop like really early, like six or seven. And if you can do that, you'll probably have everything done by uh, round eight. Um, to, re to remind you guys, the skulls, when you complete a skull, uh, it gives you 500 points. So if you ever need like a couple of points to open a door or something, remember, that those skulls will give you points when you complete that. Uh, I did do a lot of that in this video. Uh, also, when you're turning the power on, the zombies don't give you points. And when you are knifing the cocoons for the pack-a-punch part, those zombies also don't give you any points. And the last thing that I want to mention is if you do not have Perkaholic with this strategy, um, when you're buying perks, I'd only buy Jug. If you don't feel comfortable with only Jug, which you should be okay with because we're only going to round 9. After you get your buildables, you can do whatever you want. But uh, I wouldn't buy more than Jug and Quick Revive. No more than that because you need points. Like it is crazy how many points you need to open all of the doors to get all of these buildables. It's actually insane. If you can do it with like just Quick Revive or with no perks, you'll be good. But again, I, I at least recommend putting that double points on because that is going to make it so much easier. And besides that, guys, just watch the vid. I know it's a long video, but it's necessary. Uh, this uh, setup for this map is a long one. It's complicated. And if you can nail this down what I have right here it's gonna make things a lot easier a lot quicker and I think you'll enjoy the map a lot more instead of having to spend so much time trying to set up and figure out what where everything is so anyways guys that is all for now if you enjoyed the video leave it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next one peace out and enjoy I will make something of this myself. I will soon make something. 
something useful. Nikolai is like bucket, sad when empty, happy when filled. Even if everything was fully functional, I would still find this place extremely depressing. Now, what can I do with magic water? Smells like overboiled cabbage. Perhaps now we can access new area. Excitement over financial gain goes against my principles. I am excited, though. of industrial proletariat also means Nikolai not have to do work perhaps underground bunker happier place than island surface perhaps not <laughs> uh, I hope construction is strong I do not wish to be left holding handle while blade is left in helping <laughs> Inhaling airborne fungus is more vile than I expected. Maybe music will soothe its anger. Where is harmonica? Monster learned valuable lesson about anger and Russians. I think we all did. <laughs> I know not why I am drawn to shiny things. This will allow me to crack hell pig skulls with minimal effort. We may soon be able to restore power to this dark, dank island.
Perhaps we can now see things better in this wretched place. I had not realized that I hate spiders, until now. Perhaps it is gargantuan size that made up mind. Why can spiders not spin webs around hell pigs? Bye bye, click click. Hello, blam blam. I would like to try new shredding machine. I hear it is very efficient. Scraps alone are useless. Fear this once fertile land is cursed. We should not be here. Oh. 
I am not in habit of picking up skulls, or indeed any bones. Uh, placing strange skull on mysterious altar may not be best idea. Besides all the bloodshed, Skull looks cleaner now. How can we know what events we are setting in motion? Spider smells almost as bad as Swamp Hell Pig. Spore's not so bad. Weak non revolutionaries always overreact. <laughs> I'm sorry. Excuse me. <laughs> Restless souls haunt this place. What vile atrocities did Division 9 perpetrate here? Even without eyes, Skull seems to stare back at me.
touch me again, Hell Pig. Double points! Nikolai is still confused about concept of material gain. Is it not enough just to survive? So bad. <coughs> okay, uh, he's very bad. If I find more objects, I will have good collection. We must do as we did before, but differently. I am good finder of things. for this Soviet. Swamp creature is more roar than bite. You are different. I know how that feels. I am same. As long as spiders do not wrap Nikolai in web, then we may be able to coexist. We are... not going down there. They will not listen to Nikolai, then Nikolai will make them listen to Shotgun. I told you, Nikolai knew it was trap! of light cannot be evil, can it?
This was living quarters? Who's <laughs> not building quarters for spiders? Nikolai is woozy. He's most unpleasant. Oh, I do not like this sensation. Like hangover with no fun. Just making easy for Nikolai. I may forget, but he does not forgive! Island air is... Uh, acquired taste. I wear gas masks so I do not have to acquire. Ah, this is good thing. Must remember, water with 115 is not for drinking. Water with 115 is not for drinking. Water with 115 is not for drinking. I will be honest. I am hurt. Perhaps I should search area for more ammo. Fun? <laughs> you know, apart from the pieces of matter now clogging my nostrils. Your aggressive nature will be your undoing, help here. Weapon hums with power, ground beneath our feet. will consume you, hell pigs. I will stand my ground, even if it is soiled. <laughs> <laughs> 